Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie. I own Jade Brook Creates and I make all sorts of resin accessories and artwork and stuff. So yeah, I hope you've been enjoying these market videos that I have been trying to put out. Um, so this week I want to tell you some things that are happening. So I have a two day market coming up on Friday and Saturday. And this is the first time I've done like an outdoor, um, like two day market, like more than one day. And so I'm just preparing for that. And I'm just so stressed. I'm so stressed. I'm just afraid I won't have enough stuff. And yeah, it's just very, I'm running out of resin. I'm getting some tomorrow. Today is Wednesday. Show is in two days. And yeah, I'm just trying to get stuff done. The show is about almost two hours away and me and my sister can't find a an available hotel or anything close by because we're dumb and we waited too long and now everything is taken. But anyways, <sighs> trying to get past that, um, yeah, new this week I was able to do my nails and so that is how that came out really cool so i got my nails done which i hardly ever do that um but yeah i'm basically just trying to research hotels or campgrounds yeah we might have to sleep in my sister's car which that'll be fun but i mean it'll save us money i guess okay i need to stop talking about that because it's making me very stressed so yeah I'm basically just trying to get stuff done here and yeah all right let's get started hello and welcome to the floor because <laughs> we're working on the floor again yes we are because my desk is full so um anyways i wanted to tell you what's going on today today is thursday the day before this weekend starts um so yeah friday um yeah tomorrow we're leaving um uh, probably gonna leave like 8 30 or something like that i'm not sure we're gonna go grab some like brunch kind of breakfast or lunch somewhere um along the way and yeah it's it's panic mode that's what it is right now um it is currently two o'clock right now and i was up since like 9 30 working on stuff so after i'm done with this i'm going to show you what all i kind of have to do yet because it's still quite a bit of things and Right now I'm actually, I just got finished with the switch earrings, the, let me show you. Ah, I can't pick anything up with my nails. Okay, yeah. no, okay, there we go. That and I have a couple of kitties, little moth ones. Yeah, we're on the floor. Look at this. Whee! Yeah, okay, so. This weekend, I think, is gonna be really big. Yeah, so, it was kind of weird that this company, Vintage and Made, they said, like, a single space outside, which there's outside and indoor vendors. And if you have an outside space, you can either get a single or a double space. And a single space is a 10 by 20 feet deep and then a double space is 20 by 20 and I'm like wait so do I have to get another tent or what's because I've never dealt with a 10 by 20 or I didn't know that there was such a thing and then finally I got a response or from somebody saying that um you can use the 10 by 20 fully if you want to, but a lot of people just, uh, if they bring their own tent, they just have 
a 10 by 10 and then they spill out kind of into the front of their tent yet. So that's what I'm going to do because we don't really have room for two tents in my sister's car. The hours for the show is um, 4 to 8 and then Saturday is I believe 9 to 5. And yeah, it's about two hours away from me, so. Well, this place once again is looking like trash, but I'm just gonna sweep right now because there's all sorts of shavings and stuff on the floor, so. Yay! the day <laughs> we went to go get breakfast at our favorite cafe that we hardly ever get to go to and we missed the breakfast by 10 minutes got there at 11 10 and they didn't serve breakfast anymore so couldn't get a, a bagel so sadly we went to the circle k gas station nearby and got us a bagel sandwich mmm Yum. <laughs>
All right, so we just ended up switching stuff around because that wind though. The wind is not our friend today. So yeah, we just switched those two displays and then we put up all the walls and we have a little window in the back. So here's how it looks at the back of the booth. And yeah. Oh yeah, the difference today is that we have three tables instead of two. Um, because it's a bigger market and I figured we could use some more stuff. So I just put the art, um, art table over there and then notebooks and jars and stuff there and then all the jewelry here so yeah uh, yeah the wind was oh my gosh it knocked that whole display down a couple times because that was over here and the wind kept catching onto it and it kept falling over that way and that wasn't oh that was so stressful but we're, we finally got it where it's staying now, and our pegboard out there is actually, it's actually staying, so pretty proud of that, um, thank goodness, um, but yeah, the market has started at four now, but there's not really anybody walking around, so we'll just wait. We got these cool little badges. It's 6.51, so a little over an hour until the show ends for today, and then um, we'll go get Raising Canes. Yeah. The sun has finally gone away. We are no longer sweating. I'm sleeping in a car. Wee! <laughs> Ready for day two. Okay, we made it through the night. We survived. We lived. We lived. We could barely find our way through the campground. But I guess we found our spot, kind of.
but this time I was starting to get a little bit worried because it wasn't too busy right away and I was told that this was a big market but I was just hoping pe more people would come in the evening um, but that didn't really happen <laughs> <laughs> it's actually picked up quite a bit. Um, it's going better, way better than yesterday so far. So um, I don't know what else to say. Hi. amazing under here. The sun is not shining in our faces anymore. Let me show you. Nice and breezy. and I want to go home. Do you have anything to say? I'm home. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> one more hour. One more hour. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're sweating bullets over here. Are you sweating? Finally, after a long freaking day. <sighs> oh 
Hello. So it is Monday, the 25th. Um, a few days after the market this weekend. So, yeah. How did this weekend go, you may ask? Well, let's just say that it was pretty stressful. I don't know if I would do it again because of all that stress, but I don't know. We might now, like now that we know like where to go and like what to do and stuff. Um, but yeah, I don't know. The show started at four and it ended at eight. Yeah, it was, Friday was a pretty disappointing day. Um, it was, it was slow, I'll say that. Um, I had in mind that it would, this was going to be like a big show. There's like over 150 vendors. This Instagram page had like a couple thousand followers. It was pretty promising. I was like, oh, you know, this is probably going to be a really good show. Can't wait. Um, <laughs> we ended up only, it was like, we had like 16 sales. Besides it being slow, really, I mean, yeah, I was kind of just disappointed um, at that point. <laughs> I was like, this is not worth it. I mean, maybe it was my stuff. My stuff, I know my stuff is a little bit different. This is called a vintage and made market. So I don't know. I mean, I have like resin, cute little like flower resin decor. And then I also had some of my artwork, which is like um, anime style stuff. So I like, I figured people wouldn't really go for that. Um, my art stuff just but I decided to have it out anyways like people were looking to buy more like fall clothing and like pumpkins and mums and more vintagey stuff you know not this anime cutesy style earrings um, stuff like that so I don't know where we stayed for the night was at a campground which was about 20 minutes away because we made it last minute and there was no hotels in the area that our event was at. It was at least $150 or more to get a hotel for the night and so we were like well I guess we'll just go camping. Woo! And so um yeah we drove 20 minutes away and this it was like pitch black dark when we got there nobody around at the camp store so I'm pretty sure we wouldn't even have to pay we were so stressed this weekend <laughs> uh, anyways again so we did go camping but we didn't bring a tent we slept in my sister's car <laughs> yes we did <laughs> um don't do that don't don't sleep in the car it's very uncomfortable unless you lay everything flat decided to it was you know it's a small SUV and so we just decided to lay the front seats down and it didn't go down all the way flat so you know it was like so yeah something like that is how the chair was and so you know you're <laughs> you're sleeping like so uncomfortable. I, I probably woke up like, or we both woke up at least a couple times during the night. Um, yeah, don't don't do that. Don't do what we did, please. <laughs> so the sales we had 45 sales that day, which much better. Would I go back again? I don't know. I still have to think of the, about that because. There's just some things like, you know, driving, you gotta pay for gas, um, you gotta pay for hotel. I guess that's all I have to say about this show and this weekend. Um, I'm not trying to complain too much, but uh, yeah, there are those shows, you know. I guess, okay, I should be grateful for how much I made. I should, because some people, you know, would not be able to make as much as I did. Um, but yeah, I don't know, we'll see. They have a, sh a show in the spring and one in the fall, I believe. Um, in case you're wondering, the show takes place in uh, Lancaster, Ohio, which I did not mention that, I don't think. Um, but you'll see it in the title of the video. 
um, this is Lancaster is like a little bit further south than Columbus. So yeah. I think that's about all I have to say. Yeah, I don't know, just leaving the show, the traffic was pretty crazy is one thing because all of us vendors trying to leave, getting out of there. <laughs> Anyways, um, if you like this video and you want to see more, be sure to subscribe and like this video if you liked it. I'm trying to post more and more um, like after each market event, which if I, can keep up, if I can keep up with my editing, then I will be able to get it out once a week, but it's kind of hard right now. It was hard because I had weekend after weekend after weekend of markets, and so now I think I'll have some time to edit some. Be sure to follow along, and I'll see you guys at the next market or the next video. Later!